So you're a Ford man, basically? Or? No, I'm not Ford, no Ford, I'm not nothing. Nope. You ever restored a... Um, actually, that, that, what's that, a Chrysler? No, this, this is Studebaker, oh, this car. Yeah. What about... Um, ever restored a, uh, a European car? TR7. Oh, well, the <laughs> TR7 is the first European car you would have no, I restore. I didn't restore, but I had guy to the Fiat one twenty eight mm. coupe sport. Yeah. Did you do any while you were in Poland? Or? No, no, no. I left Poland when I was nineteen years old. Oh, really? Yeah. I'm, I'm not straight away here. I was a little bit around. Yeah. So you got into painting first, or you got into cars first? Um, uh, you're a car nut, or a, you got into it through I'm, doing I'm not. I'm not a painter or panel beater by trade. Oh, really? No. Yeah. I'm a, my job is the same what Milos is doing. What's that? I'm business advisor. Oh, really? Yeah, I finished university, I got two degrees. There you go. Yeah. yeah. I was yes. working... When I when I left Poland, I am. Um, um, I was nothing. I just finished high school, mm. so I was living in Greece when I left Poland, and um, and I was a guy which had a few classics, mm. and I just was sort of you know cleaning them and doing very very simple things. Mm. But that's how my sort of interest starts, you know. Yep. With the cars. So where did you start painting cars? Here in Australia. Yep. How long ago was that? Twenty years, roughly. Oh yeah, yeah. Just yeah, just I came, time sort of thing. I came here. Yeah. And uh, and start and my first job was to help in a crash repair, just help. Yeah. And slowly, slowly start doing more, and then I become a panel beater. I was panel beater for probably more than ten years. Yep. And then one with the crashes which I was working, they didn't have a painter. Like they yeah. couldn't find a painter. There been someone who read the cars. Ready to paint, and one day said, I said, Oh, well, I paint few in my backyard. Yeah, why I don't start paint for you? And first car I paint come good yeah. from this day, I'm painted. Yep, so so that's uh, your niche in life, then? Yeah. yeah, that's it. And and then I had a break, I go here, I done Flinders University, I done international business, yep. and that was not enough. I like it. So I done a business management. Yep. Another course. I couldn't find. I couldn't. Basically, I couldn't find good work in uh, here in South Australia. Everything what was was interstate. Yeah. And the kids already been in school here. We didn't want to move. We moved several times, so we don't want to move. Yeah. So I said, oh well, I just back what I'm doing. That's it. Now I'm happy with that. Yeah. I had job here in in my profession for. Two and a half years, yeah, and they just killed me this job, you know. Yeah, it's so hard. Yeah, like I have to. Initially, I was supposed to work in this business um, five days and three hours on Saturday. Yeah, that's how I signed it. Yeah. I was I was working five days, whole Saturday half Sunday really and they didn't pay me even one cent extra because Good. I was you know on a yearly wage yeah so and hours normally eight my normal eight hours they usually was 12 13 so no good for family oh, shocking yeah yeah so whenever I go to them I tell them I want a, someone else to help me so you hire someone else to help me yeah. or whatever you do I need some more time yeah. they gave me like two thousand or three thousand more yeah you know per year yeah and two or three times with that, I was okay for a short time. Then I said, Mike, you got 30 days to make a decision what you do with me. So I wait this 30 days. And I come to them and I said, what the solution? Ah, oh, what we didn't think Yes, okay, so my solution is here, my resignation. And, was yeah. and I never back to this work. And how long have you been in painting parts? Uh, from January last year, so not that long. Oh, yeah. Paint supplies is good lifestyle. Yeah, I think Gary is very good boss. Yeah. 
It's a reasonable, easy job. I think the money was, you know, a little bit not, not that good, you know? Yeah. That's okay. Yeah, and he respects your talent? Well, yeah, he is, yeah. I like, for me, it's okay because I don't have a boss in the back of me, you know, all the time watching what I'm doing. Yeah. 